the fuck is that? It is poop. Oh my god. What? What's that? Uh, uh, animal. Or no, are those acorns? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay, I guess I don't investigate enough, but like, if you're pooping, wouldn't it need to be one big poop or one little poop, not like a big pile? Like, do they all go right there? I have no idea. Like, I mean, yeah, that's how like rabbits bathroom. poop, right? Yeah. I don't oh, know. is well, it? Not that no large, idea. obviously. Is that like, but, like a, that's how rabbits? What about poop like a is, like, deer? Well, see, if Hannah uses her um, mutiny, because she said that if they split, she would use it to help a squad that's down, which I would think is mine. She's on the jack tribe, but we'll see. And Taco Bell. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I don't want to get in the food conversation. Yeah, nope. Yeah, no actually, way. we should definitely Let's actually that. Actually, don't want that. <laughs> Torture ourselves. Um, and so I just tried to have a chat with Stephanie to like gauge where she's at and I made a comment about keeping with our original tribal lines and she goes, no, we, uh, we got to stick with the, the ladies, like we got to get the men out. And I don't like that. <laughs> I have to figure out what my alternatives would be and get a sense from like Maya and maybe even Rachel, what they're thinking. I don't know. Um, we've just been kind of losing and losing, not by a lot, like we've all been doing a good job, it's just the other tribes have been doing better and you know as we go we're losing another member, putting more stress on the ones that are currently there, um, so it's been a lot. Bugs, bugs, bugs is the name of this season. This is insanity. So many bugs. This is. I I haven't even camped where the bugs have been. Stuck. Genuinely, like, like never in my life have I ever yeah, experienced so mosquitoes worse. this bad. I've never dealt with anything like this. Because apparently I drew the lucky card and uh, had my first night here in the side of the farm that is closest to the marshes. Love that. Um, so hopefully I'll trade my uh, sleeping bag tonight for a slightly less buggy night's sleep, but. Overall, it's going okay. I mean, I don't either. I'm just like, are you guys worried that they're not going to want to work with us anymore? Like, I, I don't think so. I'm not really worried about that. I think we're pretty lined up to work together until we have to take one of each other out. Okay. Like, yeah. I think that's the only thing that's going to force us to switch, and then we switch, right? We switch tactics. It's every man for themselves at that point. Yeah, and like nothing has made me feel otherwise. I was just curious what you guys. I think the two people that are in the most unique position to sort of shake things up would be Peter and Rachel. Yeah. yeah. But I think the two biggest threats once merge happens will be Matt and Rachel. I don't know if they will work together separately, but I get the vibes that they're people that are really going to try to control things. Uh, but I know that Jeff and Hannah are on board, so I'm hoping, like, come merge, we've kind of got that cluster. Um, you know, blue is going to stay blue strong post merge, full stop. That's just the smartest thing for us to do. But within that, I'm hoping that the, the few of us can stay even stronger. Um, one thing that happened during the game, so the different challenges, and obviously Green Tribe was down with Blue um, for numbers. And so during the challenge, I think it was the, the sliders, the slide one, um, they, uh, both Rachel and Peter were like begging me to throw the challenge, begging me to throw it. because they wanted to stay in and I wasn't gonna throw it like give purposely wrong things but I, I moved a little bit slower. Do I think that really made a difference? No, I think we were still gonna lose. Either way. <laughs> All right, Poda, come on in. All right, let you getting a look at the new Poda tribe. Matt voted out at the last tribal council. Uh, Wetu and Poda getting a look at the new Nebi. Alex voted out at the last tribal council. All right, welcome back to your next immunity challenge. So, what do I do need to take the immunity idol back? Immunity is back up for grabs. And two immunities once again. Yay. Two tribes will be safe, one going back to tribal council.
All right, this next challenge is called Race to Victory. Here's how it's gonna work. Four of your members are gonna be carrying this sled. You're gonna go to the left of your tiled, of your row with tile. You're gonna carry your sled to the left. Go all the way to the end. Loop around, come back down the right side, picking up your tiles along the way. Grab your bundle of tiles, put it on your sled, keep going. All four members have to be touching the sled at all times. All right, so you're only as fast as your slowest member. Okay? Once you're back here and touch this orange cone, one of you becomes the caller. You're gonna read this note, step up on the block, and tell your other three tribe members how to solve the puzzle. Puzzle are in the bundles. So those three people untie the bundles and arrange the puzzle per the instructions of the caller. Cannot help move the pieces, other three move the pieces. All right? All right. So I'll give you a couple minutes to strategize and then we'll get started. All right. If you feel like right. you're the I'm just going to go. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. no. Yeah. Who, um, who wants to sit out? Yeah. Since you can't sit mm. back to back, I feel like this isn't a lot of like. I don't know if Bobby needs anybody else. Because you can come back. I could sit out this one. Okay. And then we need one more. But maybe. I don't mind. Maybe someone who like. Or, might do physical things. Right. If it's running, I'd do that. But I, I'm happy to do this one too. It doesn't matter to me. So I'm if someone else, that's that. fine with me. Happy to do it. Happy to turn it over to you. You were seem like you were contemplating doing it. You have no interest. I'm not good enough with puzzles to want to be the caller for me. How about I sit up? Yeah, you feel good about it. Okay. Okay. Then we'll have you. Um, Players ready. Go! Right That was further than that. All guys, about even on the third. Okay, go grab it. Go grab it. Got it? Got it? Got it? Oh! Did they kick off? Oh, that'd be a little bit ahead of Wendy, but a very tight race. Good? Good. Very tight race. Drop him there, drop him there. Good job. Caller, okay, up on the board. Can I can look at this? Yeah, yeah, look at that. Step up on the block. Okay, got it. No rower at all. Same color symbol within it. Right. Oh. Four by four. I just start with four by four. Yeah, looking the same. Go diagonal with the yellow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got it. Yeah. So then the other way. Other, another thing. Yeah, the other one. Yeah. Do, do yellow. You know what helps? If you do a diagonal of every leaf. You know what I mean? If the leaves are in a diagonal. You see what I'm saying? Start at that, that corner up there. So that we're, that brown leaf. Yeah. When well, you think you've got it, yell check. It's not in the same row. We need a yellow on the bottom row. Oh, you have two torches on the bottom row whenever someone wants to take that. Blue torch can go yep. there. That works too? Oh, yeah. Yep. The leaf and the... It's the green and the blue that makes it. Okay, do you do the green and the blue first? We got a row of black. Um, so the trees with the, so we have the trees with the water, 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 water dropping is the bad one, water dropping is the bad one, wind is the bad one, can't swap for it. So, uh, water dropping is the bad one, wind is the bad one, water dropping is the bad one, and then, where's the black? Those two? Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. We're going to need a blue wind in the bottom. So, yep. Uh, oh, no. Um, no, keep no, the no, 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 I think so I think green torch then to swap to with green. No, green torch is swap with. Yeah, this is way harder. I think these need. These two. 
Well, there's two, there's two. And this is there, and that's there. All tribes trying to figure out the puzzle. I don't know how I noticed this, but on the ocean, the whole time, we would say, like, oh, you chose not to open it for the whole time. Mm -hmm. His story to us, okay, the you first know. time, it was like completely different. Mm -hmm. There were no boxes. Mm -hmm. And so, and then that's when he got up and immediately walked away and was like, yeah, I have been in trouble the whole time. And just sort of like skirted all out of that. But, um, I mentioned it to Maya and she was like, yeah, I caught that too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're going to need a blue wind in the bottom. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay. Yellow, blue wind right there. Yeah. But then that's... Wait, we need to keep the diamonds. So do that and that. And then yellow water. Blue. Oh. Oh. Yeah. They were talking about the diamonds. Do we need a diamond? I feel like that's the thing. I think yeah. there's going to be... Uh, second column doesn't have a wind, second column has two water droplets. So let's swap the green wind with the green water droplet. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I wonder if there's only one solution for this puzzle. Instructions are on the car, that's yes, all you get. the leads. But I'm saying this should be either Okay. Well, but, yeah. So we can figure that out. This, this. Swap the yellow wind with the yellow wind. Can we get a check? Check! Everybody stop! Everybody pause! Let's do it! Third column, black. You got it. You nailed it. Oh, oh, God, you got it. You guys. What the heck? What the heck? And then we have to figure out which symbol goes in which row. Okay, yep. And we got these two here. And we're going to scan stuff like this. Um, same color right here. So we got. Yeah, so it should be blue, blue. And then blue, blue. These two should be blue. So this one, this one should be blue. So These aren't, these aren't. And I think the colors might be in the wrong spot, okay. which means the puzzle which might not be solvable with this arrangement of colors. Okay. okay. Um, that's my my hunch right now. Okay, so okay. Bring the last one over. Two blacks? No, there were two leaves here. This helps you know this here too. Hold on, switch to the black one. Green, we need to go in the diagonal. It has to go in the diagonal. Nope. Uh, up. Got a green issue there. Uh, up. We already have a water droplet far left. It needs to go up in the diagonal. This one's not good. This one's not good. Look. Yeah. Which other one? With the green one. I can't the green one. I have to swap leaf. Justin. Check. Check. Pause over there, please. Pause yellow. All right, <laughs> Nevi wins the second game. So I was like panicking, not helpful. Um, <laughs> right. 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 Win. Oh, Nevi, congratulations on your second place. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> but I'll be seeing you at Tribal Council. Unfortunately, one of the four of you will be the next person voted out. But two, as part of being the first place tribe, you will get a reward. Uh, there are there's a tarp. Gatorade and some rope left, as well as there is some sustenance, some secret sustenance available as an option. So you can make that decision if you'd like some food. Uh, you can chat about it, yeah. but there will be some food on the table. You just won't know what it is, but I will deliver it to you in your tank.
blocks in the bed. I think right now. I think they're realizing that they fucked themselves. But that's what happens. We, so we, we so really won that. No, you like, guys, we, we, you crush. cannot deny that we, we earned really that. Won that. The pure joy in your face when you saw the I was like, I was like oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> <laughs> and remember what we said to the camera after the last challenge? Yeah. Somebody was like, we're going to prove it to you that, you know, we earned yep. these wins. Yep. Very 100%. next challenge. Oh, we did. I'm proud of us. We should probably just make sure everyone gets the top, so everyone gets their yeah. date. A little yeah. speed date situation. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. I guess we can just like one pair can go that way, one pair can go that way, then switch, I guess. That works. That works. Or one can stay here, one can go up the trail. That's true. Probably. I don't, don't want to climb through those. Let's stay on yeah. paths that we do. Okay. We're closer. Do you want to talk? Sure. Okay. Sucks. I really thought we could have gotten that one. Me too. But we're all tired. Yeah. We're all so. tired. And they made us like, we had to run pretty much double in that other challenge. So yeah. it's, it just is what it is. I think we're all mentally just drained. Yeah. Um, I don't want to vote either out. <laughs> There's yeah. that. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Do you have any thoughts? I don't know because like earlier on, I know we had talked about like. Him, but honestly, he's been trying so hard lately. I'm very conflicted. Um, a conflict is that you guys all really, really, really want to be here. And I've been whining about mosquitoes more than anyone else. Um, I am out of my element. I am very uncomfortable. And I'm questioning whether or not I still want to be here. So, I don't know. Um, I also worry with Tim, like, if he's feeling bad again tomorrow, do we think he will just, like, quit? I don't think he'd quit. Counterside to that. If you need me in your game, I don't want to fuck over your game by doing this. So if you need me, and I'll say the same thing to those three, those two, I'll suck it up and deal with it and stay here. But I feel very guilty taking a spot away from someone who wants to be here when I'm pretty much at my wit's end. I think, I mean, I think Hartley could be dangerous. I agree. But I also really like him and I think he would stay loyal. I think so too. Um, if you left, I think Amelia and I could move forward. Are you okay? Mm -hmm. I was kind of hoping maybe the three of us. I know. And I've got friends and the rest of Nebby as well that I know we're looking forward to joining back up at the merge. Um, and I'd be letting them down too. And I'm not wanting to go out like a punk, but I'm trying, I'm just dealing with, I've said it a few times now, like me being miserable and taking away from someone who is having fun. And that just feels wrong to me. I would vote Tim if I knew he didn't have anything. But we don't not vote him because we think he might have something. He might, he might honestly like. I'm hoping that they won't run a challenge with three, and that there'll be a merge. It puts you in the merge, for sure. Put Sarah in the merge, which is not what you wanted. She has a much better grasp of the original Nebby people than you or me or Amelia have. Mm -hmm. Um, if we do go to vote, they will make you vote for someone. I will not vote for you because in the situation of that endless tie that, um, that he talked about, Justin talked about, um, the mo person with the most votes wins. You already have two to your name. Mm -hmm. I will not vote for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Been a lot of fun, so. oh, but I'm not gonna take a seat away from someone who wants to play. I. I'll try to do your prime.
been 24 hours. Why am I so emotional? <laughs> Deprivation. It's amazing what I'm happens tired, in a day. Happy. I know. It doesn't um, feel like just a day. No. I am pretty confident that with a tribe of three and only 14 people left in the game, you guys will be marching. I don't think there'll be another challenge. And I think to take the merge away from people who are grateful to be here and who want to be here. When I'm dreading the thought of another mosquito filled night in that tent, it doesn't feel right. So I think we'll still go to tribal, but I'm gonna ask you guys to write my name. If you guys are okay with it, I'd like for you guys to make the match. Thank you. Thank you. Fuck. Can I give you a hug? Yeah. Can we have like a group hug? Can we have it? Yes. Oh my god. I love you guys. We came into this strong, y'all. It's been fun. We tried really hard here. It's so back. It's been a little bit of a tough day for the Poto Tribe. Uh, old Poto Tribe, new Poto Tribe, it's been a, it's been a rough one. Um, Sarah, how are you feeling about that boat? Only four people and not a lot of places to hide. Um, it really sucks <laughs> in general. Um, we really care about each other a lot as humans, um, our whole tribe. This is the first blue person to go, so it's, it's scary, but um, We've, we we had a really good discussion back at camp just uh, about 10 ish minutes ago. All right, Tim, so how do you make that decision of who should go in such a tight four? I made that decision. Um, and it's gonna be me tonight. Uh, we had, try to pull it together. <laughs> um, we had a good talk yesterday about how much they were enjoying themselves, um, how much they were grateful to be here, uh, how much they loved and what they were doing here and that, how far they wanted to go. And I was kind of, uh-huh, 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 the whole time. And batting away mosquitoes and feeling my empty stomach. And I've been struggling with whether or not I wanted to be here a lot of this. It's hard. It's so much harder than I thought it was. The physical challenges, the running in whatever 90 something degrees it is out there, max humidity, mosquitoes that never ever stop. And I could not in good conscience take a spot at the merge away from these people who want to be here when I can't say for certain that I do. So. I, when we were deciding who's going to go, who's going to stay, I put my own name out there. Barley, is it as simple as that? He says he wants to go, so you let him go? I believe him. I mean, I, I'm, I'm heartbroken. I, I would be heartbroken to see any one of these three other players go. We, we've really bonded since day one, and we're Nebby strong, and uh, I'm just so proud of you honestly you went out there and you killed it and you were so helpful around camp you were always there to put you know wood on the fire always there to to make sure people were okay and all i can say is thank you thank you and amelia do you think that is the the right choice right the, are these the right three to take to whatever is next whether it's a challenge whether it's a merge is this the right decision to to let him go I think everyone here is very strong and I would be happy to go further with any one of them. Mm -hmm. So that's not even a question for me. The question for me was making sure this is actually what you want. But other than that, I have no reserves about any of it. I'm conflicted and you three aren't. And that made the decision simple. All right. Is there anything else anybody wants to say? Because I won't belabor this. Um, here at Outlast, because 
Past votes could come into play. We always vote, mm -hmm. all right? Unless the tribe says we don't need to vote. Mm -hmm. But I always push, I think we should vote. Mm -hmm. Votes matter. Um, so I would say that we should vote. Yes. All right, we will vote. Anything else anybody wants to say before we do that? All right, then Amelia, you're up. This is probably going to be one of the hardest votes I ever have to put down in one of these games. It truly makes me sad, um, but I respect your choice and we love you. My vote is for Tim. Um, I'm actually really sad to be making this vote. Uh, he was kind of weird from the get-go, but he really grew on me, and I'm so proud of everything that he's done in this game. I really hope there's no shenanigans at foot. Um, but Tim, great job. Be proud of yourself, and thank you so much. Tim, I know we probably were planning on voting you out either way, and <clears throat> I'm so happy I know you and got to know you throughout this game. Thank you for being so open with us and so transparent. Um, you're a really great guy, and I hope we can hang out in the future. You guys are awesome. Thanks for letting me write your name down to protect Bartley. All right. Once I read the votes, the person will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. If anybody has a hidden immediate idol, or an advantage they would like to use, please do so now. All right, I'll read the vote. First vote, Amelia. Tim, one vote Amelia, one vote Tim. Tim, two votes Tim, one vote Amelia. And the last vote is for Tim. Tim, you can grab your torch. Thank you. Oh, my heart. You are. Thank you. You did oh. so good hanging in there today. I know it was tough. You did amazing. Thank Take good care of Nebby for me. Who <laughs> do <laughs> Your tribe has spoken, maybe you have spoken. One of those things means you are done with the game. I'm grateful for it. So All right, with that, Poda, tough decision. You're gonna head back to camp. See you in a bit. We literally, there's no more flint left on this. Great. We have to get this started because we're not restarting it. Yeah. We might just, we might just be, I mean, we should keep trying, but. No, yeah. Like, we have to do it because it's never going to start again. Oh. All right. Here's some sustenance for you all. Oh. 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 oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Guys, uh, enjoy. Thank, Thank you so Thank much. You. All right, how do we want to do those? this? Um, so, so we got so oh, sorry, chicken tenders, mott sticks. Yeah. I will need the chicken, so I will I trade know. someone mott's for a chicken. Oh, I'll, I'll have it. Yeah. I'll have a chicken tender. <laughs> I'll do that. Um, and then we got some Reese's, some sodas, and then a salad, but no utensils. Um, <laughs> I'll eat that damn salad. Yeah. Okay. TP around it. We yeah. did it! Not yet. Woo. Stephanie. Still just got going. Amazing. Okay. Yeah, great, 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 job, great, great, great. No, guys, I didn't do that at all. No, you oh, wait, wait. Slow down a little. Slow down a little. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Is that more wet? This, more this, more this, more Is that this. stick? Oh. We need wicked dry sticks. Wicked dry sticks. The driest of the sticks. Why weren't we prepared for this? <laughs> We didn't think it would We've been working on this for three hours. I know. Can we get light over here? Because we have a lot of st stuff here. And... Yeah. Okay, let's let's here. let's let it catch a little bit. I don't want to smother it. Here, I'm gonna yeah, stack some, some sticks just here. like here. Yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. That's good. That's good. That's great. Keep going. 
Am I burning Sadly, it? Okay, some of the sticks those. are on fire. Good news for helping? I got a little note for you to read. Go for it. Um, we hope you weren't ready for bed because the day is not done. Next challenge might last all night until two tribes have won. Okay. Endurance shall be will be important to have your torch keep its flame. You'll have to dig deep to move further into the game. You surely don't want to get voted out now. You've come so far. So just keep holding on. You're much stronger than you think you oh are. Oh my god. And you're much stronger than you think you are. Oh my god. So endurance and possibly strength are holding on to something. Yeah. So you'll be sending three players to compete. <gasps> players that sat out for the last mini challenge cannot sit out this time. Which I believe is Rachel <gasps> and Chelsea, endurance. right? Yeah. You need one more player endurance. to join them. Welcome to your next community challenge. How this is going to work is you'll each have a sandbag. You'll put that sandbag up over your head, keep it there for as long as you can. <laughs> if at any point you feel like you're going to drop it below your head or drop it all together, you can pass it off to one of your other tribe members and step out of the challenge. But three bags must remain above heads for your tribe to stay in the challenge. All right, you can start with two hands at some point. That may change, so be ready for that. All right. Sleep as you already know, so I'll go all night. You're going there. Alright. Good luck. Good luck, Yeah. Yeah, you guys are cut. Sad to see Tim go, but Laddie's not here right now to do this challenge. I mean, we don't have much to do tonight, to be honest. We're just going back to our little hello taco. Tarp with no fire, tarp, so no fire. <laughs> we have nothing to do, so oh. here we are. No flint? A yellow? No, we have it. We have it, we can do it. Anyone want to drop? Do you get a little bit of smoke? I mean, we've, had, we've had enough today, we're good. Yeah. <laughs> Mike's getting the worst of the smoke. Wow, you've been really nice. Huh? <laughs> you've been really nice. Sure. Mm -hmm. Pizza. <laughs> Maybe when it gets better. What would make you give up immunity check? Sushi. Sushi. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> nah. Still probably not. Probably not. Does sound does sound nice. Does sound nice. Can we talk? How long do you think you can go, Peter? Gonna have to do it oh, for boy. As long as I can. How about you, Amelia? How long you got? I 
a while. Alright. I like that. your hand and stick with it. Cannot transfer it to the other one. I'll give you a countdown. You have about 30 seconds to make your decision on which hand you'll keep. Make sure the other hand does not touch this bag at all. Alright, make your transition now. Alright, the other hand may not touch your bag in any way, shape, or form. Making a transfer. Alright, Amelia's got two bags. They're out of the challenge. Okay. You know, just make sure the bags don't touch, okay? Okay. This is so much fun, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Has dropped, which means the other two tribes you have one immunity. You can drop your sandbag. Oh. I was going down. Yeah. You yeah. were a trooper, though. <laughs> you could tell. I knew once the first handoff happened, and oh, it was probably going to end. So I was just yeah. trying to outdo that. But that was going down. So, Poto, you'll be heading to tribal council. That tribal council will be in the morning. All right, so you have some night, uh, night's rest to sleep on it. Also, each one of our winning tribes, one of the three of you will be going on a journey. <laughs> you need to make that decision now of which of the three of you will go on the journey. Yeah, probably. I mean, I want, I want to check it out. All right, you probably want to check it out too. So, I'll leave it between you. Mm. Rock, paper, scissors. Um, you can just like Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Um. All right. Who's going? Peter's going to go on the journey. All right, Nebby, I do need a decision. Uh, I'm going to go. Okay. Matthew's going to go. All right. So Matthew and Peter, the two of you now have to mutually agree to take one of them with you. So one of the POTA members will be joining you. Uh, sure. <laughs> um, we're going to take Bartley. All right. So Bartley is on a journey. So the three of you will be going on a journey in the morning. Ooh. So you have all night to think about that. Okay. Foda also come get you. So the journey will be first, and then we'll be heading to Tribal Camp. All right. So y'all can head. So which do you value more, short-term gameplay or long-term gameplay? Or do you value your vote too much to risk it? Good luck. I feel pretty good in my, place, in my place in this game right now. Um, but losing a vote at the merge is pretty tough. Um, man, because we're coming up in the merge, long term seems better, but I feel like I, just, I can't risk it. I can't risk it. Risk it. Good luck. I value my vote too much to risk it, and I will not be opening the box. Well, I'd love to think that I have a long-term game ahead of me, but we are in quite the pressure cooker with three. Uh, 
Oh my god. Oh my god. So I got an advantage that may help me a last. Uh, this is the Tribal Council Pass. You now have the power to send any two players away from Tribal Council before the votes are cast. You may choose yourself and one other person or two other people. These people cannot be voted for. They will immediately go back to camp. You play this advantage any time before Justin announces that it's time to vote. Present this note and make your decision on who to remove from Tribal Council. Once voting has begun, you may no longer use this power at the Tribal Council. This short-term play can significantly alter the course of the vote at that moment, but how will two less people voting impact the outcome? I'm deciding who goes home. Okay. Party. Um, since the swap has been pretty difficult, it seems like we got the pot of curse. Uh, last night was pretty awful. <laughs> we um, couldn't get fire started, so we took the tarp and made a little tarp taco. We swapped and then we had nothing. We had no fire last night. <sighs> the bugs kind of left us alone, but after like being so low in numbers for our challenges, we were all wiped and we could not get a fire going last night. So yesterday was tough. We uh, got swapped and then we lost consecutively four times in a row. Uh, we got rid of the two original POTA that were on the new POTA, uh, but then that left the four Nebi that had been swapped. So they begged us, begged us to drop the challenge. They knew the three of their numbers are sitting there. None of them dropped for us. So it's not like a huge shock. It's a little stressful, but it's not a huge shock. It's just harder when you're in a smaller group, but we'll see what happens. Um, and then after, like, <laughs> I was really pissy <laughs> because Rachel was just like, we're there for you guys. And I'm like, are you? I don't think you are because you, like, I didn't say that. I'm like, well, one of us is going home. So obviously you're not here for all of us. So, and she's like, well, whoever makes it. I'm like, oh. So. I did get an advantage, which is in my pocket. I have shared it with the girls because it may be a reason to keep me around. So it sucks that we're in this position of being three people going to tribal. Um, so it makes it complicated. I personally think unless they're conspiring right now to vote me out, um, me and Bartley did shake hands about saying that um, we think him and I could do well. And I agree because I think him and I are both very social players, so I think him and I together are gonna be good shields for each other, but also like we can navigate because I think we both have a good way of like kind of slithering our ways into different people's ears and relationships and such. And I don't know if Amelia has that. Um, I think Amelia's more just like, she would be a number, but I need I need somebody who's gonna be like a team with me because we really need to strategize and really get in there, um, especially being the only two that were out on this tribe. I think I have a pretty compelling case for each to vote for the other. You know, Sarah is a, a big personality. She's out here to play this game. And uh, I think that she's probably gonna do what she wants in the long term. Amelia is very tight-lipped, but she knows a lot more than she's leading on. Um, and it, as we get to know each other more and the onion sort of peels back, we're learning more and more things. I think what's best for my short-term and long-term game is actually the same person. I think it's Bartley. We connected since day one, um, and we're currently sticking together. I hope I do believe him. I think it's going to happen that way. If not, respect. All three of us deserve to be here, um, but I definitely tried to make my case of how I'm going to be helpful once we merge. Um. There's definitely been a, a lot of secrets that have been kept by both of the girls so far in the game. Um, I definitely feel like I have been the most transparent between the three of us over here. Um, so I'm just trying to, at this point, turn them against each other. All right. Welcome back, Poda. Uh, we are down to three. There is really, truly nowhere to hide. Um, so Amelia, walk me through what happened after the challenge last night and what the conversations between the three of you have been like. I mean, first off, after the challenge, we were all respectful of each other. We all know the energy we put in and 
it is what it is. Like, it, it sucks a lot. Um, and we really didn't try to strategize too much last night. We really just tried to have a decent night together and let ourselves rest. So Barley, how do you make this decision of which way you're going to vote? Um, what are you prioritizing right now? Is it the trust that you have? Is it relationships? Is who's going to be a bigger target for whatever the next phase is? Is it who's going to be a bigger threat? What are the thoughts going through your head? Yeah, so after this tribal council, there's only going to be two of us left from this new Poda tribe. And so the person that you're moving forward with really has to be someone that you can both work with which I think I could work with both of them, um, but also will benefit your game in the long run as well. Um, each of them brings strengths that could help. Um, so it's a very difficult decision to make. Um, I did get an advantage though, which um, could ensure that the two of us that move forward, move continue to move forward together uh, because I received a tribal council pass. And so at a merge, we could, in theory, decide that we don't want to go. We've had enough of uh, maybe five in a row. We could sit that one out. So, uh, yeah. So Sarah Bartley has been pretty open about his advantage. Um, how do you feel about that? How do you react to someone being that open with your group about an advantage like that? I mean, I think we're, I don't know, I'm happy. Um, I think that the three of us just genuinely care about each other. Um, so I think regardless we try I try to I always try to spin a positive note on everything so with this one I was like you know no matter what merge is probably coming whoever gets voted out in us we're all gonna eat soon and it's gonna be great so at the end of the day we can all look forward to that um, but with the advantage I don't know I'm, it doesn't make me worry you, we all know he went on a journey I know what that's like because I've gone on a journey and I lost my vote so um, I knew that it was either that or he was gonna lose his vote so that's all we could really do with that, but it doesn't really scare me. All right. In one sentence, just wanted to, to recap a little bit of your pitch. So we'll start with you, Amelia. I should stay because something along those lines. Finish the sentence for me. I should stay because in the past I've played a good swing boat game, and I think I can help us make it through this. All right, Bartley, how about for you? I should stay because I, I don't think I'm that big of a threat. Sarah? I should stay because I think I think connections wise and social wise I could help whoever I'm with get further in the game. All right. I am going to give you time if there's anything else you want to talk about. Literally every vote counts here. One vote will swing something one way or the other. So I want I don't want anyone to feel like they have anything left unsaid and they don't if you want to talk to each other, if you want to talk openly. Is there anything else we should discuss before you vote? No? All right, then we will get to the vote. This vote is not gonna be easy. I love both of the people I'm with right now. Um, it's just based on who I had that initial connection with, so. I'm voting for Sarah right now. Amelia, <clears throat> um, you're an amazing person. And I think no matter what, I think any two of us are gonna do well. Um, I just think that me and Bartley have a better chance of getting further because your name was already out there at one point. And I just think we have a better shot at really killing this game. It's nothing personal, and I can't wait to continue being friends with you. If you had asked me if I was making this vote a few rounds back, I would say no. Um, unfortunately, I have to think about how I'm moving forward in the game. All right, once the votes have been read, the person will be asked to leave the tribal council area immediately. If anybody has a hidden immunity idol or an advantage they have to play, now's the time to do so. All right, here are the votes. First vote, Amelia. 
Next vote. Sarah. One vote Amelia, one vote Sarah, one vote left. The person leaving is Amelia. It's okay. You guys have to win this. Oh my gosh. Alright, Amelia. Your tribe is spoken. Uh, she can stay. <laughs> Alright, Hoda, Bartley, Sarah. You're going to be heading out to the challenge field. Alright. Okay. Cool. cool. Alright, peace out. feel pretty at peace with my game. Um, last time I played a game it was a very strategic game and I didn't do very well on challenges and despite us losing a lot of challenges I feel like I actually did really well so I'm proud of myself in that way. Um, I'm not too surprised to be voted out here. I probably would have gotten myself out here too. Um, and you know we were just put in a tricky situation and I want those two to go and kill it so badly. Um, but yeah, I am just, I feel at peace and I feel very proud of the game I've played. Uh, definitely go out here and do this. You will get so much confidence from playing games like this. Just do it. You can do it. Mm -hmm.